Hey, what's up, y'all? It's YS back at y'all with another top sports picks for MLB. And we gonna get to it. Welcome to the stream. I appreciate y'all joining and watching. I'm gonna give y'all my bets and the top bets for me and my guy. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate all the love from everybody. Let me make sure I'm live on my YouTube channel. Sometimes it says I'm streaming and I'm not. Let's see what we got. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. All right. So we got a few games today. Let's get, start by saying that. I hope y'all like my new setup with the green screen. My new lighting could have made it a little bit more brighter, but so we got the Phillies and the Braves today, 7:15, 7:30. Let's see, it's gonna be a great game. I really want to stay away from it because the Braves got a a good relief pitcher, starting pitcher coming in starting today. He was out for like a week or two, so he might be rusty. So, but the Phillies are due. So, here's a seven pick parlay. If you're a new, new better, I would honestly say do short parlays. Don't try to get rich. Don't. Uh, uh, what do I do? No, don't waste money. Don't do none of that. If you're gonna, if you're gonna waste money, do like a six leg parlay for like ten cents, fifteen cents, to win a few bucks. If you round robbing it i would definitely suggest that spend more money it guarantees you get some money back even if you lose a bet here we got the the diamondbacks nationals mets royals astros twins san francisco giants and the dodgers i'm going live to give you all first access because the games are already starting I'm going to edit the video later, add some music, you know, do all that. But I want to go live to give y'all first look. Here's my, my pitching bets that I did. I put a few in just so I could show y'all right off of hand. And here's my home runs starting already. Joe Pedersen on the, on the Diamondbacks. As you can see, the, the D-backs already have one. They're starting to warm up and get hot. I would definitely, definitely. If you're going to do a home run, also do like two people to hit a home run. One or two. Why does it not say I'm live on my phone? Oh, it didn't say I went live all the way. Okay, okay. It says it's upcoming. Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome to YS Top Sports Picks. August 20th, Tuesday, 6.53 p.m. I appreciate all the love. Let's get to it. Hope y'all like my new green screen. Right now, I'm streaming off my laptop. So, it's not like like my setup that I usually do but I appreciate all the love make sure y'all tap in I'm going to show y'all my picks if you're a new better don't try to get rich and do like 7 like parlays if you do do like 10 cents for one and don't expect to win and always try to round robin your bets basically round robin make sure that you get some money back 
you spend more money in the long run for the round robin, but even if you lose one or two, you still get some money back. The Phillies are playing the Braves today. Um, I try to really stay away from that. The Braves are good, but the pitcher that's starting today is coming off an of injury. He's a relief pitcher slash starting pitcher, and he's been out for like two weeks, and he might be rusty. So I would definitely, if you're going to bet on them, take the over-under. Phillies might pull it out, but they just lost to the Nationals yesterday. They're winning some games, but they're not doing as good as they were. So hopefully they can pick the pace back up. So, you know. But make sure y'all smack that like button below. Let's get to it. We got the Diamondbacks over the Marlins, Nationals over the Rockies. That might be tough. As y'all can see, the Rockies already got bases loaded. That's just this is just a backup bet. New York Mets over the Baltimore Royals, Astros, Twins, Giants, and Dodgers. And the reason why I'm doing a live is because I wanted to get these bets out before so y'all can get them. And then I can edit it, add music for later. You see, as you can see, round robin. That means the sevens times eight. So it's in individually side betting them bets. So you still win some, even if one loses. I switched it up on that one. Here's my my pitching bets. Here's my home run bets. Joe Pedersen, as you can see, they already scored. Then we got Alec Burleson from the Cardinals. They play a 746 and Corey Seager. They all could hit a home run, but honestly, I would do one person or two people to hit a home run. Stop trying to do three, four, five. Because you'll get one or two, but then the third one won't won't hit it. You will not hit it. So I would just bet $3 on two people to hit a home run, and you might be better off doing that. Guarantee win. You do three, then you're mad because I lost by one. Unless you round robin it. Unless you round robin your bets. That's the best way to go. Best way to go. Honestly. Alright, let's get back to it, y'all. Here's another one. That's round robin. Always, if you do a bet and you think it's going to hit, do it straight and then do it another one with round robin. There's another one. I mixed it up. Cardinals are hot a little bit too. There's another one around Robin. There's another pick. Shorter legs. I got the Brewers, Baltimore, Reds, Guardians, Rockies. There's another one, Rangers, Cubs, Astros, Royals, Rays, Twins, Mariners. Bang. There's over-unders, over-under, over-under, over. You know. Honestly, putting the bets in before the games are not a good idea. I'm going to keep it a buck. I've been coming to interact with a lot of people on Reddit. They get a feel for all the games. They see how it's going. And then halfway through the game, or like 10, 15 minutes after it starts, they put in live bets. Honestly, that's the best way to go. Honestly. Because you don't know how these games are going to go until it starts. Then once it starts, then you can see, most chances are, if a team got good momentum, it's going to stay like that the whole game. It's not going to change. So... Live betting is the way to go. Don't put bets in sometimes before. I mean, you can if you if you think you know how the game's going to go. Simple as that. The chances are 
you could have a team to win by seven, they get in there and they don't score none, and they lose by 80. 80 home runs is crazy, but you know. Here's two bases, Turner, Joey Bart, Yoshida, Vinny, and Gavin Lux. We got another one, Ralph Robbins, by four. So I only need four people to hit, the last one can lose. And I'll still get like $6 back. Here's some more home runs. Santana, Pete Alonzo, and Marcelo Zuna. He hasn't really been hitting home runs neither. Here's some strikeouts, my pitchers. The overs are tricky. Overs are honestly tricky. They get you because Frankie Montez is probably averaging four strikeouts per game. That's why they got a four and a half. The half will always get you, I'm telling you. You might think it won't, but if you bet, I'm going to give you all the things and all the tips so you don't lose like I lose in the past. Here's some more home runs. Santana, he went to the Twins. They're hot right now. He's a good baseball player also. But yeah. Football's about to start. Basketball's about to start. So... The home runs is the way to do it, but make sure the game's live. I would wait till like half the game's over, see how it's going, and then put your bets in for people to win or lose. That's how you... Honestly, with live betting, there's no re reason to put bets in before. But if you put... Smart way to go is to put $20 on Judge to hit a home run. Judge been hitting a home run almost every game. He'll hit one one or two home runs in their first or second game and then after that he won't hit another one then the next game he will next one he might not then the next game he will goes back and forward you gotta check their stats look at all that hmm here's another one what do you like on your hot dog? ketchup, mustard you just leave it plain you don't like stuff on it? really? Mm -hmm. We got here we got Judge, Harper, Hoskins, and Rafael Devers. The Red Sox versus the Astros. That's either gonna be a low scoring game or a high scoring game. Hi Bella. Come here, girl. Come here. That's our dog. Well, this is my girl's dog, Bella. It's my baby. Give me kitchy. Give me kitchy. Give me kitchy. Give me kitchy. Oh, good girl, yeah. What? There's Kyle Schwarber, Bobby Witt, Vladimir, and Aaron Judge. Bobby Witt, he made the uh, home run derby. Great, great ball player. So is Judge, Vladimir, and Kyle Schwarber. He's due. Juan Soto, Vladimir, Kyle Schwarber. They're the three top, top people. And Judge, also. But honestly, that's, that's the way to go. I hope y'all like my advice, like my video. I appreciate it. Keep smacking that like button, keep tuning in. So, on my channel, people said this to focus on one topic. But... I got over 11 playlists on my channel. What we're gonna start doing is, we're gonna start putting each video in each playlist so it's more categorized. So y'all can, you know, know where everything is and it, my channel will be organized. You feel what I'm saying? So it'll be better. And I can upload different topics. We could do pranks, sports, bets, food reviews all that so let's see how the games are going right now let's see what we got I don't know what we games. diamondbacks are winning rockies are winning comment below if y'all doing fantasy let me know what y'all teams are looking like if y'all did y'all drafts if you didn't do your drafts we got 
I'm doing two drafts on the 24th, Saturday, August, and the 25th. One's for work and one's with my friend, my other friends. My favorite team is the Phillies. I think we're first or second. The Braves are right under us. They're not doing it. Uh, doing okay. 73 and 51. I don't know. But that's my picks, y'all. I appreciate the love. Let's go check out. Also, NFL on Thursday and Friday. Take all the unders. It's preseason. I s my homie just hit $500 off of $5. He took like seven teams for unders, under. It pays off. Because most preseason games are not going over 40, 50. So, the live bets are the way to go, yo. Appreciate the love. Smack that like button. You're now tuned in with YS. Let's see. I think I cover all the bets. Appreciate the love. Should be pretty bright. Y'all should be able to see me. But let's go. Hopefully y'all win. Hopefully y'all get three home runs in a row. Whatever you pick. Whoever you picked. I wish y'all good luck. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. I do also announce the Phillies games. Sometimes I do. If they're not too late. And they're on East Coast time. But... I appreciate the love, y'all. Peace.